Welcome back, my dark means, to my dark kingdom, ruled by me, 9151, and we're back to the WTF news, or no, it's what the beep! Yeah, that's right, I need to get that intro sooner or later, I really want to, it saves me my throat, saves my throat a bit, but yes, you have, you see, yes, if you've already heard, or if you've seen the title of my video, yes, Crunchyroll and Funimation, Funimation, <laughs> why'd I say it like that? And, but have finally, <laughs> well, separated, broke up, divorced, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, it is unfortunate that this happened. I just recently uh, found out about this yesterday, and I just wanted to to, uh, to freaking make a video on it today. I know it's a Sunday, amazingly. <laughs> yeah, and we got two videos up, which is uh, the videos up before this. But yeah, well, I digress. But yes, it is unfortunate that Funimation and Crunchyroll are now separated. It's like, yeah, basically Fun and if they, sorry, and if, what was it? What was the other information? Yeah, it's unfortunate, and what and what wasn't, and sorry, Crunchyroll isn't the one at fault this time. Yeah, we've they've had a lot like uh, they've uh, they had a lot of. Uh, <clears throat> Questionable things like the not making sure the rating system and also that app beyond belief But if you know what I'm talking about yes, but Funimation has been acquired by Sony and they decided to leave and Of course, uh, we all know it's about money that they wanted to make more money is unfortunate and they want to be a sub Not only they don't want to be, sorry. They don't want They don't only want to be a dubbed uh, 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 What was it? Uh, studio, whatever you want to call it, but also a sub as well. But unfortunately, that means they have to part ways with Crunchyroll, which is what I say is sad. But they said that it's basically everything's fine, they broke it off perfectly. But I don't really know what I don't know if that's true or not, but we're just gonna let it be. But it is unfortunate that this has happened because I have been hearing a lot that this could have been a great thing for the anime industry, which is could have been great for the anime industry because it would have brought a united front to get to bring in as many uh, anime as studios as possible together here. Just like Steam. This could have been the anime version of Steam here. But unfortunately, corporate greed has taken the stage. And unfortunately, that dream is far off now. Who knows if they will finally get another potential uh, partnership here. But don't worry. They're going to be... Re what was it? Uh, revive? Revive, I think it was called. I can't remember what it was called. Who Crunchy was partnering up with it. I think it was Revive, if I'm wrong. Or derive, derive. I don't remember, but let me know in the comments if you know who, which company is is taking over uh, the replacement of Funimation. But and they're also planning to do some new tactics here, and they will literally be giving us some new shows here as well. Unfortunately, they will be replacing basically most basically Funimation. Almost every single thing from both sides have been. All those shows are going to be removed as there as well. But thankfully, here uh, Boku no Hero Academia and Attack of Titan are going to remain for obvious reasons because they're so popular right now. But like I said, if the Funimation and the and the Crunchyroll, all any other show that was done during the partnership, is going to be removed. And like I said, Revive. If hopefully I'm saying that's the right company. If not, I'll leave the real name down below in the comments. It's not a link to their site. It's just the name for the comments. Yeah, but yeah, exactly. That's the end of this partnership. They broke up. Or they're separating now, and it's unfortunate. And like I said, this could have, and I've been hearing a lot that this could have been a great place for a united front uh, to bring in some more legality for more people to see legal anime instead of going for those uh, other sites. You know what I'm talking about. But obviously, unfortunately, it's not happening now. Yeah, I was really glad. I was really happy to see how Funimation and Crunchyroll were together for the time being. And yeah, they start, well, I think it was 2016. They got together and they were so happy. It was so great. It was so, Everything was so great. But of course, if they were their company and they got to make some money, a lot of money. 
which is unfortunate. They, it's unfortunate they have to make more money than they usually want. And I wish that that wasn't the case because it would have been a great area for people to go to without having to go to those other sites that are not are free there. Not, yeah, both naughty and not. But like I said, it's unfortunate that this has to end. And it's unfortunate that this is going to be. And yeah, it's unfortunate that we never had a chance here. Well, they, uh, the, the potential for a Steam, anime Steam like edition here could have been. But like I said, if you look at Steam, but I'm going to give you a comparison to how good this would have been. It's because if you look at Steam, like all the games are on there, except for. Uh, two uh, co uh, companies, which I'm not going to say here in case I get copyrighted off my ass, because uh, you know how they are. I'm not going to say it, but you probably know who they are. But like I said, most uh, yeah, Steam has more, basically so much games in there and so much catalog that it basically has a perfect place for every game, almost every game on there to like prosper. Unfortunately, there are some <laughs> games that are not really good, but still, it's where a place for everybody to go to. And to see all the other games here. And also to be able to make other names here as well. Sorry. But unfortunately, that dream is going to be held off, I think. The end, it seems like Crunchyroll. Yeah, like I said, Crunchyroll and freaking... Uh, what was it? Yeah, and Funimation are going to be separated now. And who knows how long before we get the opportunity... Before the anime industry gets the opportunity to make... A freaking uh, catalog of every single show on anime show here because we really need it because the anime industry really needs it considering how a lot of people are not going uh, and paying for the anime but all but going on to these sites and watching them there which is very unfortunate hopefully that one day it will come back to this and another company comes in and may be able to start this back up again but for now yeah, that's about it. Yeah, and that's all I have. But I'll oh, but just let you guys know that I'm gonna be letting you guys know that if you that I have been thinking that maybe I should expand the otaku. I mean the. T oh my lord! I'm confusing my own news with another news network. That uh, that another YouTuber does. As I was saying, I was hold up. I gotta move this thing before this stops on me. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, if I don't move that thing, my curse is just going to stop the recording on its own for some reason. But like I said, I'm actually thinking of going back to how I did it before on the WTF news. And which I mean expanding the news uh, thing. Because just to let you guys know, I'm not just going to be an anime, net, an anime uh, channel. I'm literally... I love anime. I love anime entirely. Heck, you see my content and I have anime on my channel. But I, you've also seen that I have a lot of games that are not anime. And this channel is just going to be... Is about trying... It play, I'm just going to be playing whatever I want. It's going to be whatever game I want. And it's not going to be based on one single area. It's going to be possibly any kind of game. Like I said, you've seen all the games so far. Hopefully you're enjoying them. And, and yeah, and I'm thinking of expanding the WTF news to other, uh, uh, what was it, topics that involve not that only the anime industry, but also the gaming industry, but nah, but nothing political or anything else, or any other person who is fucked up unless it involves the company, like in the game industry or in the anime industry, that's the only topics I'm going to make, but like I said, let me know in the comments if you want me to do that, or if you want me to just not bother with the... Uh, every little detail and just focus on these important things like uh what was it like a game company uh causing mishap like loot boxes and beyond belief or something happening in the anime industry just let me know in the comments if you want me to expand my topics because i really want to start going at it with here and also i've been seeing other youtubers doing like adding multiple other things here on their videos and I'm thinking about doing that let me know in the comments I'll wait like about a week before I decide if nobody answers then I'll just do it anyway well whatever <laughs> I feel why well, I'm a dictator why not I'll take my power into my own hands all right well that's about it for the WTF news hopefully to see you next time on the next news uh, episode and yeah that's about it all right leave a comment down below what was it? Yeah, leave a comment down below. Comment down below. Oh, wait. 
subscribe down below, press that little bell next to the subscribe button, and yeah, and, or just come to so you be notified whenever my channel gets updated. <clears throat> Sorry. And what else? Oh yeah, and uh, and or you just want to come to my channel every once in a while to see if I updated, and also share my videos so we can spread this new network everywhere. All right, that's about it. Alright, I'm forgetting anything. If I did, I'll let uh, let you know in the next video. Alright, my dark means dismissed.